Well, what I've found in my life is that the experiences that you've had getting into God's Word and growing creates a positive feedback loop. And what I mean by that is the more you get into it, the more you enjoy it. Growing up, my, my, dad, my dad would tell me, uh, you know, there's never, there's never a time that I, I finish reading the Bible and, and setting aside time for God's Word. And th there's never a time that I think, I wish I would have been doing something else. Um, and, and that resonates with me because, you know, when, when you, or when I dig in, into God's Word and, and, and am in, in exploring it and learning and absorbing and, and trying to grow in my faith, um, it, it, it's more often than not, you, you know, he, that's how He speaks um, to, to me, to us. It, you just find yourself having the, uh, some interaction with, some kind of interaction with what you're reading. And that interaction is, is literally with God. How is God going to work through what he has told me uh, in my day? I believe that this is one of the ways that God speaks to us. Um, I will oftentimes um, meditate and, and reflect on what I have just read and, and what I have um, written down or, or took a note, taken notes on um, and, and trying to, to find ways that God is speaking to me in my life so that I may know um, how I should live according to Him and, and how to best glorify Him. Um, it, at the beginning of John, um, it says, um, I'm gonna, hope I don't quote it wrong, what is it? In, in the beginning was the Word and the Word was with God. Word was God. In the beginning was the Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God. When you are reading, when you are listening, maybe you're an audible learner, um, you can listen to it online, you're having this interaction with God, the maker of all things. And I asked him to bring to mind people that um, I might share this with, or people that I might need to call or write a card to or pray for, I try to use that uh, so that I can bless others. And the, for the day that I'm going to have, uh, just uh, that I would be a blessing to those around me during that day. Every time you open this book, let's open this book, Rayleigh. Every time you open this book, it is an encounter with the living God who loved you so much that he would go to the cross to die for you and that he would be living today for you so that you can see him and live with him one day in eternity. The Halloween bowl of candy that just keeps on giving. <laughs>